I have come to play more Spyro. And I'm just going to assume that the microphone's working. I can't be asked anymore. To be honest, if it isn't, it's probably for the best. <laughs> Very sleepy. I'm running on four hours of sleep. And I've been awake for... Oh god, maths. Uh... I've been awake for a while. Hang on. I could do this. Uh, that would be... It's not that hard. Um, 20 hours. I've been awake for roughly 20 hours. So. Well, it'll be 20 hours in like 20 minutes. Or maybe 23 hours. Not 23 hours, maybe 19 hours. <laughs> oh, we're off to a good start. <laughs> um, so I'm not going to give any spoilers. Or really talk about it that much, but... I've just watched tonight's Doctor Who episode. If anyone's watching this in the future, it's the episode... Oh, fuck. What's it called? Um, it Takes You, It Just Takes You, or something like that. That's a really weird title. But it's the weirdest fucking episode of Doctor Who I've ever seen, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I can't say I disliked it. Um, it was it was so weird that I, I kind of just enjoyed how weird it was <laughs> when I when I realised it was one of those episodes that just goes completely off the rails. I mean, this, this episode goes so far off the rails that the rails achieve sentience and then have an abandonment complex, so it's pretty much what happens. And this reminds me of a level in Spyro Enter the Dragonfly, the PS2 one. I'm guessing this is probably what they based that level off of. Spyro! Rhinox have been harassing us all day. The workers haven't been able to harvest the bamboo needed for the Whirligig to take you to Evening Lake. We've tried asking them to leave, but there's no reasoning with them. What's a Whirligig? Just quick question. I don't actually know what a Whirligig is. Is it some kind of helicopter? That's what I'm imagining. Oh no, he's going to umbrella me to death. Yeah, this is really similar to that. I think it's like the first level in Into the Dragonfly. It has all like Asian stuff, but not just that, but like the layout's really similar as well. Like it starts with this square area and it enters into that tunnel area over there. From what I remember anyway, it's been years since I played Into the Dragonfly, but... I think I... Last time I played it, I realised how, like, janky it was, and... Kinda never went back to it. I didn't play too many of the PS2 Spyros. Ooh, an egg. What's your name? Dwight? I was going to make an office reference, but none come to mind. I watched, like, I watched, uh, I don't know how many seasons, like, two or three seasons of that show, and then something that it was leading up to for a while happened, and then I just kind of stopped watching after that, which is dumb, but, and then I went back to carry on watching it, like, a year later, and it wasn't on Netflix anymore, which is sad, but I'll probably get back to it one day somehow. It's not exactly the kind of program you need to remind yourself what happened in. Oh, these eggs were pretty close together. Oh no. <laughs> oh, come on, that would have been such a good save. to like stay up late for any reason like I've got all the free time in the world for the next week but I just feel like it I just felt like I wanted to get some more Spyro in I didn't play too much earlier and I wasn't too pleased with the quality of the stream either even though when I watched it back it was better than I thought it was at the time in my mind happens a lot to me um I've forgotten how to get up there did I go around I think I went around 
get it. It's Mary Poppins. That's what I should call this episode when the VOD comes out. Rhinoc Poppins. I like this level so far. Not much that way. No, good. Just thought I'd better check that. <laughs> Who's shooting missiles at me? That's rude. Man, oh, the music in this level too. I like the music in most levels though. It is funky. I'd say for want of a better term, but that's pretty much the best term you could possibly use. Funky's coming back. It's definitely coming back any day now. I don't know. I don't know why I did that or why I thought I'd accomplished something by doing that, but <laughs> there we go anyway. Oh, this is ringing a bell actually in my memory. I think I do remember this level. From this game, not End of a Dragonfly. Oh, the emergency escape bridge. Are you gonna sing by any chance? I shall activate it right away. By singing. Nope. Okay, that's just I thought that was going to be culturally inappropriate, but instead I was just culturally inappropriate. Oh dear. Oh, I hear an egg thief. Hey Tom. What a show off. There you are. Get back here. Wait, hang on, are the critters in this level little dragonflies? Is that a reference to Enter the Dragonfly or were they always like that? Those aren't dragonflies, are they? I don't know. I'm too tired. <laughs> too tired. <laughs> gotcha. Peewee? What kind of name is that? You'll get it eventually, just keep chasing it. I love these little things anyway. Probably a skill point related thing. Oh, I forgot to check the achievement. Hang on, there's an achievement for this level probably. Uh, I really wish there was a way to show like what I'm looking at here. Uh, follow the question mark, okay. Question mark bottles, easy peasy. Oh. Oh, the Yeti. Okay, I can't complete this level yet. Where is that and why are they all standing on each other's heads? Uh, oh, have I not been this way yet? Across here, don't think so. Rest in peace. Uh, up here. Oh, there's a whole minigame area. Can the jar move to minigame areas? Can't hurt to find out. I don't think it would. Please help us, Spyro. My friends are trying to go home after a long shift in the fields. Those rotten Rhinox keep knocking them down. Can you save the panda workers? Oh, hell yeah. Please hop aboard. Make sure to toast the Rhinox, but not my friends. Okay, this is different. Oh, is it an on-rails shooter? Nice. Doesn't 
seem too annoying. Oh, they're parachuting in. Hey. How rude. Hey. Man, I wish this could go a little bit faster. See the one on the left just fall to his death. Uh-huh. Would you like to try some I'm good, thanks. Okay, it's not letting me explore that area. That's right. I guess that ain't where that is then. I can't think of anywhere where I saw three pandas stacked on top of each other like that. I'm gonna sneeze. I need to meet my microphone. I'm gonna deafen all of you. Ooh, I'm back. Except sneezes usually come in more than once, and I've only sneezed once, so I might have to. Oh, my cat just sneezed as well. We've both got the sneezes. Gorilly. Oh, you're trying to be like me. Pro tip. Do not be like me. <laughs> um, what am I doing? I'm looking for that jar. I'll have a quick look around and if not, I'm just going to assume it's in the Yeti zone. I forgot what the Yeti's called, please forgive me. Um, three pandas stacked on top of each other. Oh, hello, found you. Can't say I ever noticed those before. Hmm. I'm not one to judge. I mean, literally what are they doing though? They just kind of stood there doing nothing. Cheeky pandas. I don't know where that is. I'm glad that's where that was. Where else? Oh boy. Would my face have been red. I feel like these are normally a bit harder. I guess this one's just never ending. Yay! Trophy get! Alrighty. So I'm kind of on the fence about whether I will stream Ratchet and Clank or not. Because while I am enjoying streaming this, at the same time, there have definitely been moments where I'm like, oh, I want to play Spyro. But I don't particularly want to like stream it. And if you've ever streamed, you probably get that. But if if you're not, then I guess the way to it's how casual. Thanks. I'll join you in a moment, Sing Sing. Uh, no matter how casual and laid back you try and make it, it's not the same as just playing by yourself. You like when you're playing games by yourself, you just kind of turn off. Um, but when you're streaming it's more of like a, you feel like you're creating something and it's just a different experience. I don't know how to explain it. 
Alright, now last time we did this to me and I skipped the speedway, so I'm gonna ignore- Oh, I'm getting PTSD just looking at that firefly. I'm gonna find the speedway and do that first. I like this hub world. I can't think of a hub world in the third game, but I don't like, to be honest. Right, is it this one? Country Speedway. Let me check the achievement. Uh, Fire five missiles in one race. Okay, that would be the race portion then. The speedway. <laughs> oh, I never get tired of his voice, I'm sorry. I love it. I wonder how they achieve that, because he's definitely saying the words. Is it just someone making the noises? This mechanics. Oh, this level looks gorgeous. They all look gorgeous. Can I do this without flying? Oh no. Oh! I forgot, I'm not charging in the air, am I? I need to flame them. Uh, you suck. Uh, you produce bad content. Get it, I'm flaming them. Why is there a boost outside of a race? I didn't know that was a thing. Oh! Oh my goodness. I wonder if I've ruined this run. Maybe by hitting that boost I would have redeemed it. Nope, apparently not. Come on, get to him! Come on, no! Ugh. Life is pain. I should have played more Spyro as a kid. I don't kind of matter what the obstacles are, the first one is always rings. There we go. Could always do that, of course. Oh no. Oh no. Just missing one ruins the whole run. I'm just going to see if I can do it. Hit the boost. I'm pretty sure I also hit an extra boost in the previous run. Okay, yeah, this is. Kaput. Ah, oh, it's a great word, isn't it? Kaput. Ooh. Those poor pigs, they're just driving along minding their own business when I come along and ruin everything. Because sport... These pigs, man. As far as just a bully. Can I pull this off? 
I should not have tried that. There we go. I think I got behind it. <sighs> okay. No more fancy tricks. We'll do it the way our insomniac overlords intended. It's not like it's difficult either, it's just it's punishing. Can't make one wrong mistake. Plus and just a nature of speedways. I wonder what those signs they're holding actually say. Quite see. Put them corners. And the last one. <gasps> Validate me, Sparks. Thank you. Oh, it's coming! Oh, he's got a big nose. And he was a 69th egg. Ay. <laughs> Sorry, can resist. I want someone to create a text-to-speech program which just uses Sparks' voice instead of anything recognisable. Wait, I didn't actually listen to what you said. No. Wait! Oh, I've already bollocks this up. Alright, this will be the practice run then, to see what's going on. So I've got to do that four times. Are they in every boost? No. Okay. Won't be quite as easy as the last speedway trophy then. Oh no, they're the red ones, I see. Lol. Fairy lady so big, oh my god. That's terrifying. Wait, is this the right way? I feel like I'm going Have I missed a checkpoint? Where am I meant to be going? <laughs> oh I've lost this, haven't I? <laughs> I just followed a random biplane. And I think I went a little bit off the beaten trail. Yeah. I'm not sure when that happened, but I'm just going to speed this up. Now, now, Spyro, don't get so frustrated. How did I miss? I wonder if a trophy is to fire them or to hit them. I'm actually not sure there. Well that's two anyway. She's so big, it's weird. Alright, I'm going this way. Go out my way for a missile, why not? Probably shouldn't have done that. Two out of three and I'm in fourth. 
damn it. Oh, I got the trophy anyway, so I don't need to worry about that in the next few laps. That's good. The next few tries. I like to say the next few tries. I don't have much faith in myself. Can I actually destroy them? Ah, oh, I missed the path. Oh, I need to fly before I hit the power-up. Okay. Man, that guy's really smoking pretty bad. Oh. There might still be time to win this. Uh, no, there's not. <laughs> Never tried to make a spin off game of this. I mean, literally every other major collector fun platformer style game ended in a vehicle combat game. You got Crash Team Racing. Uh, you got. Oh, wait, no, Ratchet and Clank didn't. But you got Jack X. Okay, so. Two out of four I was thinking of then. My point is therefore invalid. Third place, get in there. I keep forgetting to do this. Damn it. That's not good. Get out of here. Right, can I do this? Double boost! bit too cheeky to try. Damn it. Well, I'm in second. Not sure I have enough time to make it up though. Can't even see first place. Oh, I'm losing it. Oh, oh no, that's not it. Wait, what? Where are they? Oh, it doesn't automatically fail me. That's nice. It just makes me get second. Bit of a better start. I don't know if it's worth doing that kind of thing or not. About to find out. Yeah, that's definitely a little bit faster. Shit. The bed. Bloody tree! Oh, 
Oh, how did I miss that? Ooh, that was close. Oh, okay, never mind. Thought I'd it. Oh, that was a weird bend. Yeah, look, I'm way further behind now. Great. I had momentum there and I botched it. Ah, I'm losing it. That's what I've been wanting to do. Oh, first place is so far ahead, that's not fair. Mm. Probably should have gone for that missile. Oh, come on! Oh, there's no way. We gotta do this again. Yep. I'm sure I can get that other star. Do a double boost. I'm sure that trying that is probably what's making me do this. Yeah. <sighs> I should have just called this stream freaking Spyro Team Racing. Good joke. Good joke. No, oh, I missed it. Fuck you. Wasn't sure I hit that then. Okay, that screwed with me. I don't know what the point of hitting the races before first place is, they never change. Could do it anyway though. Oh come on. Why is she so big? That fairy's creepy. Okay, cool, didn't hit any boosts then, that was great. Just let it be. Why is first so far ahead? I guess the idea is that you're supposed to use the missiles to slow them down. I doubt that hit. That's the way it is, is it? Hey, there we go. Oh god, is there enough time? No! Hit it! Hit them! Hit this! Yes! Oh god, how much race course is left? Can they fire missiles? That's a problematic question, isn't it? Don't you dare blue shell, mate. Oh god. So close to the finish. Just pull this off again. No. Shit. Don't pull ahead, don't pull ahead, don't pull ahead. No. Stay away. Stay away, stay away, stay away, stay away. Yes. Oh, I did it. I am the greatest. Right, Sparks. Um, Hunter's probably around somewhere. 
Oh, I'm so tired. Uh, uh, yeah, Hunter's rescue mission. Okay, where's Hunter hiding? I'll find him. Don't you worry, I will find him. Probably up here. Yeah. Spyro, you're not gonna believe this, but there this house is really big. And space cows all over this place. Again? Gotta stop them before they abduct somebody. Okay. I'm gonna strap on my jetpack and blast some space cows. That's a sentence. Look out, cows! Here I come. That's a better sentence. It's Hunter's pickup line. <laughs> oh, never on my off shoes a second. weird because you play as Hunter in these segments but he still gives Spyro an egg. It's like he's rewarding you for something he did. I missed. No! Leave him alone, don't you know? Oh. Someone just clip this and then put Murray Gold's Dark and Endless Dalek Knight over the top of it. <laughs> I've been on a soundtrack uh, binge, if you couldn't tell. I'm making a playlist full of all the best soundtracks, but the problem is I've started with Doctor Who soundtracks and there's a lot of them and it's taking me a long time to get through them. And then I'm going to do Game of Thrones. And then I don't know, anime soundtracks, followed by like video game soundtracks, but then there's a huge amount of those to choose from as well, so I probably won't make that playlist in public for quite some time. But yeah, making uh, Spotify playlists appears to be a new hobby of mine. <laughs> Thing is, I don't know I'll make any more after this, I can't think of any anything else I could do it for. Got the last one just before he abducted this egg! Roberto. Gotta take a picture of my cat, she's being a cutie. Hang on, this is important. Be quiet, Sparks. This is important. Perfect. I must send that image to my sister. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Sparks. You're lazy. Is it ever established why Spyro can only glide most of the time? Except for speedway levels. I guess it's not important. Just gameplay mechanic. Oh my goodness. I'm so sleepy. Okay, that's that done, apart from Bamboo Terrace. It's really weird to me how in these games you don't have the same amounts of levels in different hub worlds. Like it was the same in Spyro 2. In Spyro 2 you had three hub worlds and the first one had some levels. The mid one had most of them, then the last one had like the least amount if I remember rightly. It's just so weird. Uh, where was that balloon again? Someone get Spider-Man. He'll find it. My balloon! I did unmute myself, right? Okay, good. I forget to do that sometimes when I'm talking on Discord. I'll be like, why is Reese ignoring me? And then I'll realise. I've run right past it. <laughs> Just remembered what those trees used to look like on the PS1 version. I think they were much smaller. I think. Problem is, I didn't replay the PS1 versions before this came out. So, 
I should probably have done that. That would have been cool. But I don't really have the time to do stuff like that nowadays. I like the pandas, let's talk to you. Oh, this is what a whirly gig is. All of my questions are finally answered. Let's go to Evening Lake. Really, they didn't call it Sunset something. That would have been better. Or Dusk somewhere. Or Twilight somewhere. No, they called it Evening. Evening Lake. What's Evening Lake like in the morning? Don't know. It's just evening. Big pants. You bumbling, idiotic, worthless fool! I asked you to carry out one simple task and you fail me! I should have known better than to rely on a child. But don't worry about it. I'll deal with them now. These eggs can't be worth all this trouble. Without the dragons, the magic in this world will wither away. Without magic, I'll die. And so will your ever slim chance of becoming a sorceress. Now, watch how a real sorceress dispatches her enemies. Release me from this cage, you merciless miscreants! How would you like some dragon for <gasps> lunch? <laughs> Why, if I had my club, you'd all be in for... Uh... Oh, you big. That's interesting. They actually bother to explain the motivations of the villain in this. Never realized that before. Nasty Nork was just, he got called ugly. Told me the sorceress would attack you here, so <laughs> so it was just, he was power. mean. It seems my rocket launchers don't affect this creature, but I can assist you by dropping ammunition. Now get in there and fight the good fight. As long as I don't have to play as you, I'm fine. Okay. That's a bit basic. That's not much different to the last one. Ow! I'm guessing it has different phases. There it is. There's a... Any kind of achievement for... Oh! Ooh, okay. Ooh, I like this. Hello. Oh no, he's got it first. What's the two from? Easy peasy. I lost track of what I was saying. Oh, it's too intense. Oh yeah, I'm wondering if there's an achievement. Ow. Oh, really? <laughs> that was pathetic. Wonder if there's an achievement based around defeating this guy. I'm having a good time. Just want to know that. Chat. Or whoever's watching the VOD. Probably no one, but. It doesn't matter. Yeah? You got it first? What are you gonna do? Nothing? Oh. Bit shit. I'm so bad at these bosses. They're simple enough, but. Lord, I mean, never to play Dark Souls. I mean, I have played it. I've beat the first boss of Dark Souls 1, that's as far as I've gone. The second boss. Fuck it, can't do it. I could probably do it if I persevered, but I just haven't. Honestly, most games don't come down to skill, they come down to perseverance. And I guess you could measure skill as coming from that, like you've trained or whatever, but. I'm a big fan of hard platformers. I don't count spiders, but those are not. Um What does that perp one do? Oh that. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Okay. It's back. No dragon for lunch today is the name of that trophy. I 
think that's probably for... Hang on, I'm going to have a look. Oh, it's just for defeating him. Okay. Ooh. Level complete! Let's get out of here. Oh, look at Spyro. He's sitting there so patiently. What a boy. What an absolute lad. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Did I wake you up? Talking to my cat now, by the way. I've realized that's not always apparent. She's so fluffy. Okay, new hub world. Ooh. So this would put us about halfway through the game. Spyro, this is serious I think. now. The sorceress is planning a trap for you, and if she catches you, believe me, you don't want to know what she's going to do. Look, I promise to take good care of the rest of the eggs. I mean it. Just take Hunter and go back home before... Before... I can't say it. Just go. What fate is so bad that you can't even say it? Is she going to turn us into frogs? Oh, I've had my fair share of frogs today. Thank you. I don't remember this rocket. Oh, that's just a one to the next one. Okay. Frozen altar. Water mechanics. Yeah. What's up here? Oh. Fucking slave trader money bags. Place the Yeti with some DLC and you've got EA right here. <laughs> the sorceress has a real prize on her hands here. It took two dozen Rhinox to capture this dim-witted furball, so you'd better believe he's not going to get out cheap. <laughs> no deal, dirtbag. <laughs> okay. Where are you getting all this money, Spyro? <laughs> it's not just lying around on the ground, is it? Uh, is it? Yes, it is. What do I care? It's mine now. Club him. Smack him. The first rejuvenating breath of freedom. With the humility of a wounded I like his design. I genuflect to my noble deliverer. Uh, it was no big deal, dude. Yes. <laughs> After all, it was I who let you out. Why you brazenly avaricious, duplicitous, larcenous ursite? Now hold on! Hey, I actually know what all those words mean this time. I remember hearing that as a kid and being like, One more What does that mean? <laughs> At least. <laughs> Please do afford me the sublime honor of enjoying your visitation in the nearest future. Yeah, sure. Oh, I get it. Yes, he's a man to be dumb, but he's really smart. Har har har. I like how story wise Spyro literally just visits and says hi. It's like, okay, cool. Thanks for visiting. Bye. I've got some stuff to do. Because <laughs> obviously you play as the characters he visits. Oh, Bentley, that's his name. How could I forget? I, I think he's quite slow. But first, I must attend to my young sibling. I'm afraid he may have gotten himself into trouble during my absence. How did you even fit through that little way? Smack. Oops. <laughs> really cool that boulder. A swift smack should do the trick. Okay, I guess he's not as slow as I remember. Although, the camera is a little bit too zoomed in. 
Can he just smack those open? That would be nice. Oh, he can. Get out. Oi! Go away. This camera angle, it feels like I'm playing Darksiders or something. <laughs> A game I've played like four hours of, by the way. If you use your spin move to deflect the snowball into the gong, I bet we can make the roof cave in. All right. Uh huh. Ah, uh, I see. <laughs> Just squash the dragon. Hey, it's Brian, but this one's spelt with an I. You're running out of names, Insomniac. Did that do something? No, it didn't. Oh, I can actually squish him, that's wonderful. It took me forever to train those seals to throw snowballs. Now they've gone and turned on me. That's a bit rude, isn't it? Yeah, I'm sure I can deal with that. Who's putting all these chests at the top of all these tiki totems? Is that what it's called? Or is it just totems? Oh no, another seal! And this one looks really mean. Never fear. All might is here. <laughs> This one's so mean, he can move from side to side. The meanest of seals. Tell me I didn't need to keep him alive for some reason. That would make me sad. Oh, you're not a chest! I'll just steal your money instead. I'm sure that guy has something very important to say to me, but I just don't care. I'm a big yeti and I smash things, what else do I need to know? Also I think I've got a degree in mathematics or something. Oh, really gonna make me jump down for those gems. I feel like this guy was more annoying to control than on the PS1. But then Sergeant Bird wasn't as annoying to control so there's been a change over there. Alright. Class an avalanche with this one. Woo! Avalanches are always good. Bit rude. Put someone's eye out. Okay, fine. That's how physics works. I'm sure I could have just reached over with my club and done it myself. Also, that is not how avalanches work. Shouldn't be any problem for you to push it out of the way, though. Me be strong. Me use HM move strength. Uh, when me figure out how. Oh, why did me get degree in mathematics and not box pushing? Um. Oh, am I supposed to push it from this side? Okay. Oh, I got a skill point because I put it all the way in the hole. Interesting. Fell in the hole. <laughs> Man, this dragon seems really smart. Get it. Do, do, do. I bet this dragon's called Christian. I mean, um, Critigree. Because that's definitely my birth name. I actually have like an alter ego name I've dreamed up, but I will never reveal it unless I use it to do something that makes me more famous than my regular name is, which wouldn't be difficult. I'm gonna be like, surprise, it was me all along. That's right, I'm actually JK Rowling. I shouldn't have revealed that. 
Uh, let's crush some rabbits, it'll make us feel better. Oh, I didn't even need to kill that one. <laughs> Oops. That was just mean. Oh, I think my cat's farted. Wonderful. I shouldn't have woken her up. What's this rude dude over here doing? He's just hanging out. Time to end his life. That's discrimination, that is. Just because he's a rhino. He might be a nice rhino. I feel like I'm missing something back there. No, I did go and get that, didn't I? Oh, I'm sure there was something. This is quite clearly the end of the level. It's totem destruction. Oh no, I didn't miss anything. Are we running? Thanks, bro. Here's a little something for your rock collection. You can probably tell. I enjoy smacking people. Oh, this works. Uh, hey! Let me in! Let me in! It's cold out here! Okay. Guess I'm gonna T-pose. <laughs> it's not quite a T-pose, but it's good enough. For some reason it took some time for me to warm up to this game, but this stream it's really kind of kicked in. Maybe it's the sleep deprivation. But I really enjoyed Spyro 1 and 2, but at the beginning of Spyro 3, after the nostalgia passed, I was just a bit like... It was just controls for Sergeant Bird, I just got a bit salty, I think. Alright, now before we do anything else in this world, let's go complete the other one. Because that's how I play Spyro. I just had that really sad moment where I reached down for a swig of my Pepsi and found out that I'm all out of Pepsi. The reason I drink way too much Pepsi is to avoid moments like this. Moments when I need more Pepsi. You can never have too much Pepsi in your life. Until you get fat. Like me. And then you've had too much Pepsi and it's time to stop, but you can't stop because Pepsi's too delicious. This stream is not sponsored by Pepsi, but if it was... That'd be cool. <laughs> hey Pepsi. Send the get your people to contact my people. And by my people I mean me. <laughs> Hit me up. We can make some dosh together. I am an influencer. Oh god, this joke's gone off too long. Uh. Here we go, it's Yeti time. I was just heading to the top of my favourite hill. Alright then. Good premise for a level. I'm off walking. Oh, I need to go walk hey, up to you. I think they saw some Reinhardt run up to the top of that hill with an A. Man, I just wanted a hike. Fuck you. Oh, look at that. Panda head. SMASH THE PANDA HEAD! Oh, there was nothing inside. I'm just a vandal. Oh, that was just to show me that I can do that. Okay. It was a tutorial panda head. Man, there's a lot of panda heads here. I haven't seen this many panda heads since World of Warcraft's fourth expansion. That little pedestal we just walked by is bugging me. So I'm like, what's that going to for? Oh, it's used for rolling heads. Oh, but TNT. A bit rude that was. Didn't have much chance to react. Oh, Sparks, you're feeling green. I'm sorry, man. Can I bat it back? No, I definitely cannot bat it back. 
Also, seeing a squished Yeti is the dumbest thing. I love it. Wait, uh, come back, come back here, you little shit. Let me squish you. Wanna smash? There we go. Uh, yeah, okay, cool. Okay, that was bull. I mean, I saw it coming and it wasn't bull, but it was bull. I might die here. Oh, okay, I died here. <laughs> and he bashed his umbrella on my face just to rub it in. <laughs> that was really rude. I'm sad now. When I woke up all those years ago, I didn't think I would wake up to it. Oh, shut up! <laughs> that was good, I came back there. I would have missed it as otherwise. I didn't think I'd wake up to a day where I got my face mushed in with an umbrella. Man, that timing is weird. How do I avoid the TNT here? It just kind of happened. Is there a curtain? Just gonna have to hope it doesn't happen again. Okay, that's the way to deal with those guys. In fact, that's probably the way to deal with everything. Let's just do that. Okay, everything except jumping rolling stones. There we go. I'm unstoppable. It's a little bit terrifying. Oi! I was unstoppable, how dare you? Uh, we should probably go get a critter. <laughs> He's just like, no, please! <laughs> Not the Yeti! <laughs> no! <laughs> I commend you for your sacrifice, brave dragonfly. Two games from now, I'm sure I'll run around and save you, but alas. Oh wait, no, it's Spyro 3, that's the next game. In this game, you're just Sparks fodder. Actually, isn't that a bit messed up? Sparks is a dragonfly himself, and then I'm running around squishing dragonflies to get health. Let's not think about that for too long. This is like that level in Super Mario 64. Am I about to fight Big Bob Bomb? Bob 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 It's really hard to say. It's not that hard to say. <laughs> Just dumb. Oh no, I've been smacked. Good thing I am the king of bigger smacks. The king of bigger smacks. Oh, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. Oh, it's Brubeck, of course. How could I forget Brubeck? Yes, well done. Good show. Um, oh, okay, there's more dudes to squish. Because apparently I'm missing gems. <laughs> I was fooling them. That were good. Man, that, that face he pulled as he died. That was just like his life flashing before his eyes. Did I double smack him? Wait. You're telling me there's a gem inside of Bartholomew? Alright. There's gotta be a skill point for this at least, right? <laughs> Guess not. <laughs> Alright, I clearly missed something then. What did I miss? Oh, behind the waterfall, is it? No? Oh, fuck off. How was I supposed to find that? Wait, where? 
Where? Oh, you can go underneath, okay. It's a bit more reasonable. Wait, where now? I was gonna say, that leads off into the abyss. When you think about it, bottom the bottomless pits that are in platforming games are kind of terrifying. Oh, look at all these gems I missed. Like an idiot. Speedrun ruined. Huh, I wonder where I should go now. Okay, this was just for extra lives. I mean, it was a pretty obvious wall crack. Okay, so we're done here. Now let's go to Evening Lake and 100% that. If I fall asleep between this loading screen and Evening Lake, just tell Twitch to stop broadcasting. <laughs> Alright, let's get these gems. Oh, why does it have to be a water level? Is the entire hub a water level? I hope not. Pretty much is. Wonderful. Illuminate water levels. Oh, cool, I missed it. Oof. <laughs> I thought I had a message then, but it's just my phone telling me I got low battery. I'm popular today. But most of the people who I talk to just they've been silent all evening. It's a little bit suspicious. They've either died or they're all having a party without me. Hopefully the former <laughs> I'm checking. Uh that was mean. Oh god, that's a giant whale about to eat my face. And the rest of me, presumably. Ugh, oh, the worst part about water levels is there's just so many places that gems can hide. And the movement isn't great. for a minute. Dooby dooby doo.
I wonder who climbs these ladders. With, oh, there's probably a spark that will do in the other hub. Oh well. I wonder who climbs those ladders without jumping up them. They must be a psychopath. Because it takes so long. Uh. Hi again, Spyro. This power up can make you invincible, but only for a I short know. while. Mm -hmm. Use it to get by these flame spitters. You'll really? Find an egg when you get past them. No way. Well, you can fly. Why don't you just give me the egg? Huh? Stew it for dragon. There it goes. Never see his like again. Wait, no, sorry, hang on, that's the dying people. What's up here? Oh, this is just the top of the, um, whatever it's called. But wait, there's more. Heard you're a racist now, father. So there's one dragon egg left to get. Oh, there's two. Glide to the tower. Um, this is the town, right? Is it not? I'm confused. Oh no, I'm, I'm very confused. Please help. I'm so confused. And then there's one more egg somewhere else. But I'm not sure where. I hope I'm still intelligible at this point. I'm mostly muttering. Uh, oh, hang on. I see there's a little... Oh, I'm not going to make it. Oh my god. I think I have to go all the way back up there now. Unless I can do it from here. Can I do it from here? There's no way. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. This dragon gets <laughs> egg. Hello. That's eighty. I wonder how many dragon eggs there are in this game. Belly of the whale. Am I supposed to have the shield power up and get eaten? Is that how that works? That's how I would imagine it works. Because you can't take damage while you're shielded. And if it's in the belly of a whale... Or maybe I just need to get eaten. Maybe it's not that convoluted. Only one way to find out. Because I can't imagine that you can keep the shield power up for long enough. Oh god, I can't be able to do this. Oh! He's just stopped dead still. I've broken him. Hi. Nope, let me in. Is that a real challenge? He tries not to eat you. Uh, gross. Look at this. Jonah. Very nice. Literary references. I've never actually read that. Ew. Gross. I like his big buck teeth though. Alright, what's the first level? What time is it? I feel like I could keep going, but you know what? I should probably get some sleep. It's been fun though. I'll continue this stream tomorrow at some point. Ooh, and I will be at least 50% more intelligible on that stream. Oh, that's the plan anyway. See you then!